All right, what's up everyone? This is Jack Spot from Windows Phone Hacker, and I'm just going to give you a quick look at something pretty neat today uh, that came out from .com to over on XGA Developers, where he has assembled a Windows Phone 7.5 ROM for the HTC HD7. Um, so first off, uh, basically, you'll have to excuse me because my HD7 has a bit of an issue with the screen up here, but hopefully you'll be able to get the gist of what's going on in the video. Maybe I can mitigate this a bit by zooming in. Um, anyway, so really the important, uh, if I had to summarize this video in five seconds, the important thing to say is that not a lot has changed. Um, here we have the new Windows Phone 7.8 start screen where you can get your tiles and uh, resize them uh, to the bigger size or the little square size and put them down again. And uh, I guess you can do this with apps too. Go ahead and pin that. I can resize it, make it smaller, all that stuff. Move them around. And really, other than that, there is not a lot changed. Uh, I can head over into settings. And um, for some reason, themes doesn't work. And that's sort of another recurring thing with this uh, with this uh, example ROM because just the way the way it's put together, um, it's really unstable. You know, it's a it's a pre-release ROM plus. Um, a lot of the packages are sort of mixed together because there's not an, a, an official ROM for this uh, device. Um, so .com had to put together both the 7.5 and 7.8 packages. Um, but you can see over in Internet Explorer that the user agent is still the same familiar Windows Phone 7.5 that we know and love. and um, if I head over into the About page, you see the bid, build number is uh, 7.10.8835.35, uh, making this Windows Phone 7.8. Um, and again, other than that, there's really not a lot that's changed here. Um, this ROM is was put together very quickly from uh, what .com has uh, described it as. Um, so it's not it's not rooted or unlocked or anything, but it's sort of an example of uh, what what's in the ROM and stuff. And there are a few changes you'll notice. Um, you can you can uh, share things over here. You can um, this, the back button over here is gone because of the new start screen, etc. Um, also, I have noticed that marketplace applications don't really seem to load up on this ROM, which is a little bit unfortunate. Um, so this. This ROM really isn't something that you could use on a daily basis. However, it's you know it is an example ROM, and um, we're certainly gr um, at least I am. I'm certainly grateful to .com for sharing this. And hopefully, some cool hacks will be able to come out from this. So, if you like the video, be sure to let me know. Um, and if you have any questions about the uh, this ROM in particular, you can go ahead and let me know at WindowsFunHacker.com.